Hello, in this video I will tell you how to connect Arduino on a board with MATLAB. So here is a Arduino on a board and connected by USB cable to the USB port of the laptop. And let's move further for the MATLAB procedure. Open MATLAB. In order to connect to Arduino board to the Mac, uh, to MATLAB, uh, first we need to install the support package provided by the MATLAB itself. For installing the support package, we need to uh, press this command support package installer. It will pop up a new window and it will ask whether you want to install it from internet or download from the internet. So I, we will select install from the internet, then go for next. It will give a list of the uh, packages which MATLAB provides. Then connect Arduino. I have already installed it so an reinstall icon is there but if you are doing it first time install button will be there then click on the next button and MATLAB will install the complete uh, package for you. When you uh, completed the installation process of the support package then just type Arduino command just type Arduino So it will take some time while communicating with the board and uh, it will give you answer with the following like uh, uh, COM port to which your Arduino board is connected, board name, UNO and the available analog pins. So in UNO board there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 analog pins and some of the digital pins are connected. So all the information about the board uh, will be given here. Even uh, if you once your Arduino board is connected, that board will be shown at, at here in the port Arduino in a COM24. So the same COM24 is being used or displayed by the MATLAB itself. And suppose you can also access the same thing from this command COM20, comma, UNN. The previous event was due to the COM20 is already open so I can't open it again without clearing the previous COM. So again you can use another command like Arduino COM20 UNO for doing the same purpose. So even uh, first time when you will run this command Arduino so there will be a sign uh, downloading uh, or updating the server program on Arduino board. So if everything goes fine, then that updating of the server program will be successful. Then you can further continue from this part. So that's it for this video. Thank you.